Hey guys, John Fitzson here at my shop. I'm going to explain some things to you that you guys will find interesting. This is a big ass Damascus steel knife. Look at this. That we made up for a guy in California. Guy, great guy. He's uh, into uh, Filipino martial arts. Um, he knows his shit. Uh, but when he ordered this, and it's nothing bad about him or anything like that, you guys. He just didn't realize. When you order a knife, I try to tell people, let me tell you what feels good, what doesn't. He wanted an 18-inch sword, basically. When we got him an 18-inch sword on Damascus, this is actually table and uh, L6. It kicks ass. And it's a Frankenstein. He goes, John, I want a Frankenstein 18 inches, quarter inch thick. I even have his uh, paperwork right here. Uh, so anyway, we did it up for him. And you know what? I told him it was going to be clunky. And I knew he was not going to like it. Sure enough, he didn't like it. He goes, John, I can't maneuver it. I go, dude, I told you. So anyway, what we're doing, you can see how he threw it out. We're going to thin it out and make it more what he wants. But this thing cuts like you can't fucking believe. This thing cuts like nobody's business. But it really is too hard to wield. On a blade like this, you need a handle at least that long. Which I told him, I said, you need a real long handle, but you wanted a shorter handle because they do the moves, the, you know, the twirling stuff and everything. But um, it's really a neat piece of Damascus. But if you can see that up close, this is a piece of mild steel, this handle, up and through here. Can you see where it bees right there? Mm -hmm. And it's hammer forged in, then you go to the Damascus. And it's tougher than shit. This damn thing is just tough. But I'm going to be grinding it. I'm going to go down to this uh, thing right here, take that much off, maybe do a feather grind on it, and I'll be showing you. It's going to be cool. So be watching for it, guys. And uh, But remember, when I uh, talk to you on your knife and tell you on stuff, you know, I've been there and done that. I've done this since I was 14. And nothing against the one guy. He knows his stuff. Boy, you have to see the guy move. He really knows his, his stuff. Uh, but it's just too, too massive. Uh, I mean, even for a big guy like me. I mean, I can move it, but i got to do a lot of shoulder moves to where I can't just do with my my wrist like you can a Frankenstein. And so when you order a knife, let me kind of mold you a little bit. I know what I'm talking about. And uh, kind of go, go from there. So, you know. But anyway, just wanted to show you that. It's going to be a real kick-ass. We'll show you when it's done. I think you guys are going to get a big kick out of it. 18 inches of Damascus. Charlie was supposed to be here. I don't know where Charlie is. I guess he's down. We're doing the Colt knife, and we're trying to get that up really quick. So, anyway, um, God, guys, thanks for watching. And uh, there's a little hint for you when you order a knife from me, especially a custom knife. You want it to move fast in your hand? Listen to Johnny. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Remember. So, anyway, talk to you guys later. Say bye. See ya.